Yeah. Okay, right now about 8.18 on a Saturday morning. I know we have a lot of uh, people up and they want, you know, there's like, well, first of all, hi, this is uh, Carrie McDougall from Badger Realty. Good morning, <laughs> Carrie. Good nice morning, to morning. see you. And a lot of people come up and they're like, you're so lucky to live here, you know? And then we they want to start are. looking around and, uh, you know, buying, buying that property. So, yeah. uh, and of course, um, Badger Realty has been for what, like 50 years? Oh my gosh, we have been in business for over 50 years, mm -hmm. yes. Yep. Nice. And, uh, you know, for those people driving around in foliage, you'll find your offices here, but also in, in other places around. Uh, yes, we yeah. have three offices in the Valley. Um, we have one right here in downtown North Conway. That's sort mm -hmm. of our headquarters. Sure. And then we have one up in Jackson on Main Street. Mm -hmm. And then also, if you keep heading north in Berlin, we also have an office there on Main Street. Oh, there you go. Yeah. So just keep on riding up and uh, you'll, see, you'll see one of the offices. Absolutely. So uh, how's the market? The market's hot. Things are moving fast. Mm -hmm. um, you know, when there's a popular yeah. property, you've got to be ready to roll. I, I keep joking. I said, you better have your running shoes on and they better be laced up and ready mm -hmm. um, because it can be a race to the finish right now with a desirable property. Um, and, you know, if you're a buyer and you are looking for something that's in a competitive price range, mm -hmm. um, you know, for example, I had a penthouse condo listed up at the Seasons at Atatash, great mm -hmm. location, not far from the slopes. Yeah. yeah. Um, and we had two agents in the area go FaceTime their clients from the unit because these clients were in Massachusetts. Mm -hmm. And by the end of that day, both of them had put in offers sight unseen. One of them got it. And it just shows you when there's something that's hot, um, you better be ready to move fast and, and even potentially be a little bit creative, although I'm not a huge fan of sight unseen. Uh -huh. um, you know, otherwise you may miss out. But, that, but that's amazing because, of course, you know, every, everything now, you know, people go to the website and they have to get their homes prepared, you know, for the photos and stuff yeah. like that. So now, like, this is sort of like the evolution, the next step to actually come in, you get out your phone and, you know, can, right. can you look in the corner, please? To see yeah, I'm, exactly. <laughs> wow, that's, that, that's amazing. So, so what, what can, can the buyer do in terms of, do you want to go in? Do you want to make sure that, uh, you know, you could get a loan? What, what, what sort of things can help have them uh, in yeah. those uh, running shoes that you were sort of talking about? You know? Yeah, no, it's an, it's an absolutely great question. Um, well, so first off, you know, if I'm working with a buyer, I don't love them going sight unseen. I mean, mm -hmm. if, if they're that motivated, then I'm not going to stop them and I'm happy to help. But it is a little bit, you know, to buy something you haven't been in isn't sure. ideal. Um, but, you know, if you do see something that you like, then the key is there's a chance you could end up in a multiple offer situation. Mm -hmm. And in that case, you want to be able from the onset, from the very first step forward, to be able to put your best foot forward. Mm -hmm. And in order to do that, there are just little things that you should have lined up. Um, and one of them is if you're going to finance the purchase, right. then have a pre-approval letter. Because if I'm a listing agent and I have multiple offers in front of me, mm -hmm. then what I'm going to say to my clients is, oh, yeah, you know, these people, yes, you know, if, if they like this offer, great. But I want to see proof that they actually can get the financing if their offer is contingent on financing. Mm -hmm. You know, I don't feel in this market it's smart to just gamble that they may have talked to an age, you know, a, a mortgage lender in a couple of weeks or, mm -hmm. I mean, pardon me, a couple of days sure. or, um, you know, just take their word for it. And they could be perfectly great people, but we still want to see that proof. Right. You know, the other thing is mm -hmm. folks will go in with cash and, you know, we always hear the expression cash is king. Mm -hmm. Cash is great. You know, as an agent, I love to see cash on an mm -hmm. offer and I think sure. most sellers do as well. But two things to note is there's more than one king in the world. And so even though you may be paying cash, it doesn't mean that you necessarily can come in low. Mm -hmm. um, it has value, but it's been my experience that nine times out of 10, if I've got a cash offer here and I have a finance offer here, and let's say there's five to $10,000 difference, right. The people will take the financing to put more money in their pocket. Right, they will gamble right. to some degree. Um, you know, if you are going cash, be prepared to show proof you have those funds. Mm -hmm. So, you know, that can feel a little bit odd to people. Bring the gym bag. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> Backpack. Backpack, let's get the shoes on. <laughs> right. Yeah. Um, but, you know, be, be ready to have that documentation and be ready to hand it over quickly and easily because, again, somebody who has multiple offers in front of them, they want to be assured the one they go mm -hmm. with 
is, is as solid as it possibly can be. Mm -hmm. And any data, <clears throat> pardon me, that you can provide to show that is a good thing. It'll only help you. Right. And uh, with the different types of properties uh, that a lot of, uh, you know, sort of va vacation, you know, weekend people want, want to buy, are, are, you know, chalets going or condos more? Or are you seeing sort of people wanting, you know, regular, you know, homes, if, if you will? Is anything more going more than the, the other? I mean, um, so <clears throat> most of our buyers are second home buyers. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> so when they're looking, more often than not, um, <clears throat> pardon me, they want something that doesn't necessarily feel like their primary home. Okay. You know, they want something that has kind of a mountain feel to it. Or, you know, a lot of folks love chalets. Mm -hmm. You know, Linderhof is very popular for that reason. Mm -hmm. um, you know, Idleweiss over in Madison seems nice, sure. sees nice activity because of that. It has a mountain feel. It's, it feels like an escape or sure. a getaway. Sure. Um, condos are always very popular because, again, given that we're predominantly a second home market, right. um, folks want to buy something that's going to be low maintenance or, you know, that has great amenities. So when sure. they come up, they, if it's a rainy day or the slopes are too cold, um, you know, they can still play. Nice. Well, uh, Kerry McDougal, Badger Realty, where can people uh, view these properties online? Absolutely. Good question. Um, you can go to badgerrealty.com and just to spell that, it's B-A-D-G-E-R R-E-A-L-T-Y dot com. Um, you can call us. Our, mm -hmm. our main number at our North Conway office is 603-356-5757. Feel free to ask for me, Carrie mm -hmm. McDougal, yes. and I'll be happy to help. Well, Carrie, thank you very much for thank stopping you, by. And uh, <laughs> go online or give Carrie a call. We'll be back after this. <laughs>